Sounds good. Hey, -o. I'll go first. You ready? Yeah, good to go. Okay. Right, tap, play an autumn river. Like this. Put it at the bottom. And use one to play swamp buffalo and pass. Alright. Uh, just so. Play out a humble village. Oh yes, foot soldier time. Let's go. I like it. <laughs> uh, where's my little duder? Uh, right. And it's uh, yeah, your go. All right. Untap. Draw from the spell book. Tap to go to two mana. Trigger its atlas ability. Uh, we'll put it on the bottom. And we will tap the Moose Swamp Buffalo here and pass. Alright. Draw a spell. Uh, I'm going to tap to. Do I do this now? Yeah, why don't we try? I'll <laughs> I'm loving this card, man. <laughs> right. I'll move foot soldiers up. I'll cast a crusade here. Gotcha. And yeah. then I'll pop the sinkhole to destroy this in your buffalo. Yep. And that's that's my go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright. On tap. One. Uh, we'll go Atlas this time. Tap to play that here. Go back to two. And oh, that was, sinkhole was bad. <laughs> um, I was curious. That, to be yeah, <laughs> fast turn. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna draw Atlas this turn. Good. So I'll play another village here. Mm-hmm. Rubble. Got another foot soldier. Um, and I think I'll just attack the site for two. Yep, take two. And that's that'll be my turn. This is because it's an aura of with and all ores are four unless it says the Otherwise, so the, it's contained. The Crusades contain all four of these squares, correct? It is, yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Untap. Mm. Uh, go from the Atlas. Uh, we will tap to play a Mirage. Okay. 
and then we're gonna put the spring river here trigger the ability uh, keep it on top at three Um, play Deep Sea Mermaid Submerged. How do you do that little, tr uh, the trick? The, uh, pull it. Uh, alt right click. So hold the deck, alt right click? Yep, yep. Ah, sweet. Thanks, man. <laughs> uh, so that leaves me with no mana and pass. Alright, alright. On top, on top. Um, I'll draw Atlas. Sure. Um, <laughs> About to die by a million foot soldiers. <laughs> <laughs> I'll attack uh, the site for two. Take two. I'll attack the Mirage for two. Mm, take two. I'll cast Red Desert and just target this site, I guess. Mm hmm. And three mana, I'll play a Giantess here. <laughs> Sleeping Giant, okay. Your Sable and Star Hurt, when she awakes, she may strike another minion here. And she's a six power because of the Crusade. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty good, man, because then it's ultimately going to stay there for... Yeah, that's a good uh, synergy. Yeah, I did right. Nice. <laughs> uh, go ahead. Uh, we will... Oh, and actually, this one lost its extra power, so it was just... You're actually at 15. Gotcha. Okay, miss that. No worries. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna go from the... We'll go from the Atlas again. Okay. We're gonna tap. We're gonna play Tadpoles here. We've got three threshold for it. And we're gonna put three frog tokens. And can I submerge them or no? Does that have to be on top? Uh, I'm not actually sure. There was a bit of discussion because it just says put three frog tokens. It yeah, we'll we'll just re we'll read it as is. So there's, we'll just keep yeah. them on surface. Oh man, my poor fro my poor frogs are vulnerable. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then let's see here. So I got four total. One, two, three, four. Um, we'll use uh, two mana to play Tainiats here. We will flood the site. Okay. And we will keep them submerged. And we will pass. Alright. Uh, untapping. I'm going to draw a spell this time I'm gonna play a uh, red desert here and ping my giantess to wake her up oh boy here we go <laughs> yeah yep. uh, and how are we doing this let's uh, I'll attack the mirage for two Take two. Uh, I'll attack it for two again. Mm. Take two. And then I will attack it for six. Uh, block. Okay. And with the block. Or after the block, I guess. I can cast Crown of the Victor. Oh my god, <laughs> the sleepless giant. 
now she has <laughs> nine power and gives buffs. Good golly. <laughs> uh, that's that's my turn. Sounds... I'm very susceptible to a flood or a uh, drown, but yeah. yeah. We'll untap, uh, draw from the spellbook. I'm gonna tap to play cool. a mirror realm, cloning the oh, tadpole. Cool. Um, I am then going to tap to move this guy here, tap to move this guy here, and then this guy is going to be submerged. Okay. Maybe. <laughs> Come on, TTS. Alright. <laughs> right. TTS struggles. Yeah. Um, then... What do I got? One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to use three mana to go to two. To play Fae Changeling to bounce your giant Yo. back to your hand. Uh, there we go. Actually, I'm going to play him here. Because it could be summoned in the site. Two mana to play Tide Dyads here. And I will not submerge them and pass. Alright. Well, not looking as good now. Okay, I'm going to draw a spell. I think that works. I'm going to tap, draw another spell. Alright, so it's a little weird, but I'm going to try it. <laughs> so I will Screaming Skull onto a Foot Soldier. Okay. <laughs> and then, oh, let me move these. Can I move them both at the same time? Not really. Alright, and then I will overpower the Foot Soldier. Holy moly, okay. <laughs> I'll come through this, but... Uh, so it's up to four power now. Yeah. So I will attack the Tide Nyads. Yeah, Tide Nyads are dead. So on top, I will pick up the Crown of Victor because they have defeated an enemy. Yeah. And <laughs> one mana left. I uh, um we'll do something. I guess. Yeah, I'll attack the Mirage for three. Uh, I'll take three. And that's that's my go. <laughs> <laughs> Two, three, five powers. This is a five power foot soldier, right? Two. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Ten. Uh, draw from spell book. Soldier. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna move this frog here, move this frog here. Keep this frog submerged. Where's that frog? I uh, use five to play Ruler of uh, Thol. Oh, sweet. Alright. So these froggies are all ones now. <laughs> and, uh,. I will ping you. We'll, tr we'll try to get on the board here. We're going to ping you for yeah, one. You. Yeah. <laughs> Pass you, bud. All right. We're 
draw a spell. I guess I'll draw a sight here. And then four mana still. Oh, these guys are untapped. So. Uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. so oh, same thing. No, oh, it's <laughs> Um, Same as Crusade. Yep. No creatures to spell it. So, um, this beefed up foot soldier is going to attack the ruler. Um, I'm going to chump block with the, the frog. Nah, then they will untap after defeating the frog. Mm -hmm. uh, attack the ruler. Um, yep. That's five damage on it and it has four five oh so it's dead mm -hmm. fine take it back uh n do i no so you are so one two three yeah five yeah um i think that's all right we'll carry it through anyways okay rulers down Still have two mana available, so these are over here. A little awkward, but fine. And I'll just attack this site for three, technically, because it's getting both of these buffs. Yeah. Uh. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Hmm. Take three. And that's my go there. All right, uh, let's see, untap, Ch -ch -ch -ch. draw from the spell book. Uh, we'll use two to place Swan Maidens here. Yep. Um, thinking if I want to submerge them or not. Oh, well, they're airborne, so uh, we're good. Two there. Okay. Um, now, can I tap to... On this, no, I have to wait till next turn to pick up the relic, right? Yes. A, uh... And yeah, you can uh, it may acquire the crown, so I have to kill somebody. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, pass. <laughs> uh, right. Actually, yeah. before, before I pass, let me tap to just at least draw a sight. Okay, yeah. Now it's your go. Alright, so tap and tap. Draw a spell. So I'll start off with the Phosphorus Stone on my Sorcerer. Very nice. I will play a <laughs> single here. Yeah. Um. Then what? I'll cast a Phantasmal Shade over here. That seems reasonable. Each nearby enemy. It's so... not great against things. <laughs> it's gonna get small real quick. Uh, so... Oh, maybe I should do it here? It's nearby enemies, which is a little awkward. Yeah, so it's a five, so three power, but then you're buffed by the, which goes back yeah, to five. Get it. Yeah. Um. And I think <laughs> we're going to summon a giantess with your frogs. Uh huh. I already see what's happening here. You gonna sack this, play a land. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the hope. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I think I'll attack this site for three first. Um, he's a two, right? Yeah, yeah he's a two, two power. Yep. Um, take three. And then, yeah, the sinkhole, the spring river. And yeah, 
yeah, that's that's my turn. Oh, did you hit you hit with the fate changeling last turn? Eight. Yeah. Mm. Right. Uh, your go. Alright, untap, untap. Uh, we're gonna play um, we're gonna tap. Let's play a mirage. Here. Get you. Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, you're just playing the mirage. Yeah. Are you bouncing the table? Oh, yeah, okay. bouncing the table there. Yeah. No, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> really use that skull again. Uh. Frog galore. <laughs> that was three tadpole ponds this game yeah, yeah. <laughs> one two three four five okay so just five um oh, this is getting... okay so the crown's still up for grabs the shade is a five five we will pass these guys can't be submerged under the mirage that's right there yeah okay they're all up pass. Sweet drawing a spell oh, attack. Sure, I will draw another spell. It's going to be a slow turn, so I will just. The foot soldiers are really carrying me in this game. Flaming sword <laughs> on the foot soldier. There is plus one power at the end of each turn to one damage to all nearby units. Oh my goodness, okay. Sure. The bane of frogs. Yep, the the frogs are. Li I'm just gonna start clearing them here. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna pass the turn. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna. Uh, yeah, that wait, submerge. So wait. Uh, no, it wasn't. Uh, okay. Uh, these guys Three. are gone. Yep. Two. All gone. Uh, giantess is awake now. She's like got hair. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so awesome. <laughs> and that's that's my turn. Yep. All right. Oh, and your avatar technically hit took yeah, one. Yeah, took one. That's correct. <laughs> Yikes. Um, we will untap. We will draw from the spell book. We're going to use three to drown your foot soldier. Oh, yeah. So now, is the, is the relic submerged then too? Or relic. Or a, oh, it's either a minion or a relic. Um, so yeah, yeah, I'll take a, care of the minion. So then I could acquire the the crown. Um, minions that killed an enemy, so they didn't cast. They didn't the kill. Spell. They, yeah, those guys. The, yeah. the it was a spellcaster technically because they would have cast the drown, and then you can pick it up. But I don't think in this case. Right. Speaking of, where did other oh, she is? <laughs> um, dang, I was trying to <laughs> make something out of nothing. Um, I guess I'll just use this because I I need to. Um, so let's see, let's do two. Technically, this is, let's see, one, two, three was a mirror, and it was tadpole. Okay, I'm gonna play uh, tadpole, or play of frogs. Put a, put a frog token into play on up to seven water sites. So if I don't have seven water sites, can I only put it on three? Is it, or is it just like, do I just add all a total of seven to water sites. Put a frog token into play on up to seven water sites. So I think it's just one frog per site. One frog per site. So it's one, seven. two, three, four. Uh, well, three. I guess this one's not. Yeah. Oh, uh, it'd be four because uh, this is still flooded. So it's and mirror realms a copy of tap. Right. Okay. So <laughs> four. Four frogs. So how much is that? Nine from the. 
that's 13 frogs this game yeah <laughs> 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 uh, and that will be now can I submerge them or just put it on the, yeah on okay that's me alright untapping yeah I'll draw a spell again Alright, well, I'll attempt to move to the site to pick up the flaming sword and technically block it. Yeah, block movement. Frog. Yeah. Uh, so the flaming sword's still hanging out there. Um, <laughs> I guess I go and attack, try and attack your avatar. Um... One turn, I got a death door. Here, I need to summon another frog here. Okay, I'll get a death door. Alright. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna draw another spell. I should have done that before, I'm sure. But... Um. These guys actually get the same buff just hanging out between these two, so I'll just put them there. Yep. Uh, that was two mana because of stone, and I'll play another. <laughs> I love it, man. That is great. <laughs> um, go ahead. Yeah, that's my turn. All right, well, I'll untap, draw from the spell book. I need something. Uh, that's not gonna do it. Uh, use four to put my bullfrog here. Oh yeah, swallow these guys, I guess. Is it? Uh, just swallow a nearby minion. Um, hmm. I guess I'm just gonna swallow. I'll swallow your uh, your slumbering giant giantness there. All right. Uh, I'll just put her there, I guess. Yep. So I'm going to Okay. So it's not dead, it's just disabled in my belly. <laughs> <laughs> disabled X2? Yep. <laughs> um, and then I am just uh, going to prepare for... Okay, you don't have the flaming sword yet, right? It's not attached no, to... Yeah. Okay. Um. Yep, we're just gonna prepare for death. Pass. <laughs> well, actually, before I pass, I'm gonna tap the yeah. draw site. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's just, and then uh, we're gonna ping it for one too. Sorry. Hey, Seventeen. <laughs> yeah, I'm just clamoring to pick up this sword again after I fumbled <laughs> it. Basically, <laughs> the flavor's pretty funny there. Um. Oh. There we go. Uh. Yeah. Draw. Spell. Draw another spell. Sure. I'll pick up the flaming sword. Yep. Okay, and pass the turn. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. Dead. Dead. Uh, and then it would ping your avatar for the oh, final damage. For the final oh. damage off of that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's just flaming sword. <laughs> that's good, good stuff. Good game, man. Good <laughs> game. <laughs> well, I, I guess my bullfrog spits out your uh, your giant giantress. Oh yeah. <laughs> Surrounded by large women. Oh man, yeah that that was uh that was interesting. I love how the uh the waking up the giant that was um that was really cool. That was a heck of a game, really. <laughs> Man, frog galore and uh giant dresses <laughs> <laughs> and foot soldier action man the foot soldiers were mvp, were MVP. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> i was quite a line doing the overpower and then he's got the crown <laughs> so gonna have to add that to bodkin's story <laughs> all right everybody this is michael with mean mugging games um just got finished on playing a great game and got my butt kicked. As you can see, the score was 17 to 0. But it was a very fun game. Um, I had frogs everywhere, and he took care of my frogs. Um, but uh, 
this is the gentleman I was playing against. I don't want to butcher his uh, name because everybody knows I'm really bad with names. So um, please introduce yourself and uh, give us the deck tech on uh, on what you played and and how you like literally just killed me easily. <laughs> All right, all right. Uh, I'm Haggard Clover, and uh, I beat through 13 frogs today. Yes. Um, we got uh, three element aggro, uh, helmed by sorcerer, because it gives you some extra draw. So this is actually, all things considered, kind of minion light. Um, some of our cheap threats are boss troll, seasoned spell sword, because you don't really mind too much about discarding. Um... The mercenaries here being free is quite relevant if you can get a crusade or a jihad out early and then cast those on top of it. It's pretty, pretty spicy. Uh, other key threats here, phantasmal shade, getting it out early enough against low threats is just a big beater. Um, sleeping giantess also can be quite an all-star. Get her out <laughs> turn three and either hit her with a desert or a uh, flaming sword activation. Uh, where's the, where's the sword right at? Oh, oh, it's up here in the uh, relics. Okay. Uh, just that early five power is, is so key. You don't have so, a lot of one mana creatures, so you're really looking for the high powered early drop threats. So literally um, you're just, you lay out, you lay out your desert, it pings your, your giantess, she wakes up and uh, you got a big old five, five uh, giantess coming at you. <laughs> it's so great. <laughs> no. uh, revenants are just a nice, uh, real revenants are a good uh, mana sink late game. I haven't found them too useful yet, but it, it may. Uh, Vanguard Knights are also pretty great with the Crusade Jihad. If you get that out early, it's just another five power threat. It's, uh, seems to be the specialty for this one. Mm -hmm. uh, we got your strong relics here. Crown is fantastic because if you get a big thing out early, tendency is it's going to kill something. Uh, Crown's an easy equip there. Screaming Skull helps you clean up some minions. Um, we have some of the unique pumps here. Also, when they come in handy, they are just fantastic. Uh, we got a little common sense um, tutor package here. Um, what are you? Uh, you don't what are you? What are you trying to tutor on that? Uh, it depends. It's basically, if you're looking for another power spell, you can pick it up with the overpowers. Late game to finish off a uh, tough to get uh, avatar from death's door. There's the one of lightning bolt. <laughs> uh, mad dash for some extra reach. I've had the movement come in, uh, come in clutch when one of my minions died with a couple of the relics, so it can run in there and pick it up again. Oh, it's pretty, yeah. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah. Draw a card. Right? That's uh, that's fantastic. <laughs> that's pretty good. I like um, that. Heck yeah. Uh, Philosopher Stones just kind of really good in the three mana thing where I'm trying to cast stuff for as cheap as possible. Right. Uh, and Unluckily Alliance to draw. I've never really had it draw. Uh, three, it's usually just four mana draw two, but that's not so bad um, to refill. And that's, that's the main deck. Gotcha. Uh, go over the Atlas a little bit if you want. But it's yeah, yeah, cool. sounds good. The, the, the Atlas was very uh, entertaining today. Um. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these little... Um, the villages give you foot soldiers that uh, if you have nothing else to equip with the East uh, equipment in the deck. Foot soldiers make a really, really good, uh, really good target for them. Yep. Um, one of Vesuvius, never a bad idea. Can kill things, can hit the avatar. It's just some extra damage on a site. It's just never a bad thing. Uh, sinkholes here, because I really just want to get up to about four sites, is basically where I'm comfortable after that, or even before that. If I'm facing up a ramp or a couple early threats, sinkhole's great for taking them out. <laughs> yeah. And which is great, too. I mean, destroy the site, destroying the adjacent site, and burrow ground minions there. So, 
water deck, anything that's not earth that doesn't have burrow, um, the sinkhole just buries them and kills his minions. Fan it's fantastic. I think people are sleeping on this, like you said. Uh, that's a uh, great card, great, great Atlas card. <laughs> it is, and you can move minions up to it, and it only destroys the stuff on the adjacent side, so not the stuff on the sinkhole as well, which is, yeah, pretty good for this aggressive type of deck. Mm -hmm. Keep the keep the minions pushing. Uh, deserts, I already talked about a little bit. They're mainly here to trigger Giantist. Occasionally, they'll clean up a blocker here or there, but it's, it's mainly for the Giantist. Gotcha. Gotcha. And then just your just your bunch of handful of dual lands to really the only win cards we have are the shade and the lightning bolt. Oh, and the revenants. Oh, and the likely alliance. I changed this deck a little bit. So there's quite a few. <laughs> but you only really need one threshold, so you're not too keen on pushing that out as much as you can. So yeah, that's basically the deck. Uh, Flaming Sword is what really cut through all the uh, tadpoles for me. Yeah, the uh, yeah, it surely did. It it literally, I think it single-handedly took out all thirteen frogs um, over the course of the game. Uh, yeah, it was, <laughs> it was really strong. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh. Um. So that's that's pretty well the deck. Great deck, great, very, very fun to play against. Um, ah, it's, it's, a, it, it's a great deck builder. So good job on that, man. Um, <laughs> what was uh, what, what do you call it on the? If anybody's watching or is gonna watch this, uh, um, I know your deck's on Curiosa.io. Um, what's his name? They want to play with it. Uh, three E. Three E. Okay. Awesome, man. Well, I appreciate the game. Thank you for the deck tech. Um, you know, uh, love to play some more games with you and do some more deck techs. If you got other ones, uh, I look forward to future games. Um, got any uh, last words for the, for the people? All right, man. Um, thanks for the games. Uh, hope to play against some more people on Tabletop Simulator. We're still waiting for paper, but uh, I'm so keen, and it's still a lot of fun, so... I hope to see some more of you guys around. That was good. Thanks for tuning in. This is Michael Mean Mugging yeah. Games. Peace.